I recently like to think of music as something I find and not something I construct. And I collect things into batches of objects that convey something. <sighs> Let's exaggerate it. Okay, that's interesting. So more. I build my own catalogs in my life with dictionaries or lists or data sets so that I can see them. Uh, once I see them, I can work with them, I can filter them, I can choose the one that makes me butt beat my heart, the one that I don't want to see anymore. It's some push okay. that I had till I was perhaps 10 or 11, like you, you want to explore something and you go in depth into that. I'm not sure that's healthy. I mean, it's hard to say everything to say anything. In a sense, I think I use algorithms like Beethoven could have used uh, a piano, like uh, with this same kind of interactivity. It's not the ideal thing you have, but it's a very fast interface for me to use, like coding, trying out something, it doesn't work, let's try them something else. And so this is a sort of emanation of that and it's still, you can say it's a gadget in a sense. But that's the other side I like, it's the hardware side. It's not, it's not just in the cloud, it's not just uh, in the air. This is uh, extremely homemade, it's, uh, uh, it's, it's very bad as quality is concerned. But it's fun to be outside your comfort zone and, and, and you discover things and you learn how things work. Oh, it's just ended, I have to change the... The kids' playground is over there, so we have to go over there to check it. This does sound creepy, right? Now that's not working gonna fall down anyway. <clears throat> Let's try the other ones. No. Sorry. These ones don't work at all. <sighs> Perhaps that one squeaks. And every time you can hear that there's an A, there's a B, but the B is always a bit different. Uh, and the A also slightly, but a bit less. So the B has a lot of variation, the A a little bit less. One thing I like to do is to like match them with other sounds. Like what if I take the sounds of my daughter? What, what happens if her sound recreates the swing? It's still about repetition and variation. So it's, a, it's, it's really a way of finding some form that I can relate to right now, although it's never as simple as it sounds. And this is not a piece. This is something that I've try, I'm trying to work towards a piece. So it's a sort of sketch. Sometimes I find fascinating to stay here like at two o'clock at night and hear back progression that just go on and on forever. In Baroque music, it's a bit like if, I don't know, harmony goes in autopilot mode. But there's something in there. It's like if we have taken some object and put it in the zoo and it should be in the wild. 
that's that's something I've been thinking about. These you you asked me why I like lines because lines are in the wild and I like that very much. I don't know what that is. I never know what that is because it's not a piece. If you do something for a concert, you're no longer in the wild. You have to abide to social rules. But life is just something that goes on whether you want it or not because you're a little speck of dust in something that. <laughs> um, really doesn't care about each one individual but that's why we could care because it's a, it's it's a large dance and uh, i think this is part of it i mean this idea of uh, being in a flow that uh, just goes on it's it's also soothing in a way <laughs> <laughs> 